Right, we've got a jam-packed glass is sitting here in front of me on the floor almost. That's how full this glass is at the moment. Um, but if you are following us online or in class, try and keep up because we are going to be doing the start, the foundational, the very important, the techniques that you will be using for the rest of your engineering graphics and design career. Okay, these are the foundational we call it geometrical construction techniques that you will be using in different drawings over the course of the next few years. So, we are bezig met the meetkundige construction techniques that you can use for a whole clump of years in different techniques. It is absolutely fundamental that you hear these constructions understand and in any time can do. Of course, we are going to start you off right here at the very beginning, very simple with things that you might have done in technology or in even some of you in um, mathematics. So let's get started. So on page 4.1 of the HSE workbook, I'm going to zoom in so that you really see what we are talking about. They're giving us different lines, segments, and they're asking us to draw, construct a perpendicular bisector for each of the given lines. All construction must be shown. Construeer een middel loodlijn vir elk van die gegewe lijne, alle constructie moet getoon word. Ok, so they've placed them at different angles here. Alright, and I think most of you can remember this maybe from technology. What you're going to do is you're going to take your compass and you're going to set it to a size more than at least half of that line segment. Ok, so you're going to set it to any size as long as it is bigger than half, and I mean you can estimate it, approximate it, okay? And we're going to go on the end here, and we're going to do an arc in construction, and another arc. We're going to flip our compass, keeping the radius exactly the same, doing another arc, and another arc. And where they bisect, that is the perpendicular by sector. Okay? I know for you at all. So I vat my passer, enige grote, groter as die helfte. Okay? And I make a boog aan die een kant, boog aan die ander kant. Vat my passer om, na die ander punt toe. Ik kan nou nie net enige plek hier plaas, ek moet nou op die, op die einde plaas, nie? Weer een boog, al twee kante, waar hy snui, trek ek my middel loodlijn. En geliefdes, vriende, familie, daai is 90 grade. That's 90 degrees, and what's the other thing? Is this line here is exactly the same length as that line. It's in the center, Mr. Venter. Happy? Perpendicular bisector. We've got two things that's true. This line is in the center, so it is bisected my line, and is perpendicular. Now we're going to just step it up a little notch here. It's now, all they're trying to do is they're trying to test you. Okay? So you take your compass again. Any size on that end, for bigger than half of it, I can make it whatever size I want, as long as it's more than half. Arc on this end, arc on that end, keeping the radius the same. Some of you are like, ah, yes, why did I choose the subject? This is easy, man. This is like easy stuff. No problem here. Got this. I got this. I hope so. All right. There's the perpendicular bisector. And the truth again is that is our 90 degree. And ladies and gentlemen, that is this, the center or bisector equally um, equal length. Okay. Middle root line. 90 grade in beide kante is dezelfde lengte. Happy chaps, any questions? Right, we're going to run on to the next two. I'm going to just quickly do them for you while you do it with me. Uh, before we're going on to the next challenge in this exercise. Again, any size tip. I like to make sound defects. You can get your own sound effect. Tip. Tip. All right. Throw it. And it is a 90 degree. There we go. Next one. Each time you can try different radius to see if I'm lying or if I'm telling the truth. All right. 
my line is maybe a bit dark. Why? Because you are looking on a screen. Okay? And I want you to be able to see it. How light should your construction lines be? Who would like to kind of give me indication? Who lucht moet jou construction line wees? It must barely be visible if I stand next to you. Ne? Your construction lines must be visible to you who's drawing, but not to the guy on the opposite table. Alright? I'm making it a bit dark because you guys are watching on the screen. I want to make sure you get that. Alright, this is... Any questions on the first one? Shouldn't have... Alright, let's go on to the next one. Okay, these are some of the easier ones still. Alright, now they want us to bisect the given angle. So they've given us here two instances and I want us to bisect each of the given angles again showing all constructions. Al vier elk van die gegewe hoeke, al vier vind met die ander woorde die middel van dit, alle constructie moet getoon word. Now they add that disclaimer every time, all construction must be shown, because they don't want you to take your protractor of a glade boog of Whatever, you have to construct it. Okay, let's see. We're going to bisect this angle here. So this angle, we're going to half it. That's what bisecting means. We're going to half it. We're going to half it. We're going to half it. We're going to do Look at this. Take your compass. Again, any size here. All right, any size. On this end, do it with me. On this end, make a mark. Make a mark. Am I, am I worried? No, I'm confident. Then I place that same compass here. I can keep the radius the same. Tip, flip it, tip, and this video should get likes galore because I've just shown you the easiest way to bisect a given angle. I saw you see a jaw drop. Amazing, huh? <laughs> <laughs> Alright, let's do the next one. They give you any angle. You take your compass, any size, ladies and gentlemen, any size. You can try it. We can make a smaller one. Tip, tip. I keep the radius the same. Of course, you can change the radius if you want to, but you can keep it the same. Tip, tip. And I think for this one, I need you to subscribe to this channel. <laughs> You've liked it for the first one, now you've subscribed for the second one. All right. All right, let's see if they can give you a bit more difficult one. What about this? What? Look at this one. What do I do now? People, you are the future engineers of this country. What do you do? They're just testing you. Look here. Any size. Chip. Chip. Keep the size the same. Maybe let's make it a bit bigger just to show you the, that I'm not lying. Any angle. Chip. So you've liked the first one. You've described for the second one. And I'd like you to now share this one. <laughs> All right. There we go. I've bisected. I can. I who call fear. Is it nodig for me with an Afrikaans there all? Here is allemaal bij, allemaal blij. Happy? Right here, that is under 10 minutes how you draw a perpendicular bisector on any line and how you bisect any given angle. Right here, now it's your turn.